That's the first day of class. Um, today is September 7th, 2016. I'm on my way to my um, concepts class, dental hygiene concepts. I am currently, I'm not feeling too good. I mean, I'm not sick or anything, it's just my emotions are just um, getting the best of me. I, last semester, I failed dental hygiene um, clinic, so I wasn't able to continue the program. This should have been my second year into the program, but I have to redo my first year. Not all of the, I don't have to do all of the classes, but I just have to do the classes, the class that I fail along with another class because they go hand in hand even if I pass the other class. Um, I'm feeling very, like, when I failed, I felt extremely depressed. I was so sad. Um, I still, I have mixed emotions all the time about what I'm doing. I'm not sure, but I'm going to push it push it through because I studied it and I want to finish it so um yeah I feel very very sad I feel like I don't know what I'm doing with my life everything feels blurry right now my mother um currently does not have a stable place to stay in the United States she was staying with her friend but Something happened, something horrible happened where she couldn't stay there anymore. It had nothing to do with her, but it was just another party that was involved. Um, my mother is legal in the United States. She just does not have a home to stay. And I, on the other I myself, I'm staying with my dad. But she can't really stay with us because my dad married another woman. So we be good. I feel very depressed. I'm trying to finish my education and be able to provide for her. But right now it's kind of really, really hard since I'm not feeling too good. Um, I'm trying to like just get it together. That's, that is what that is what my that is what I'm reaching for, but it's extremely hard at this time to just do the right thing. I wanna. I was thinking slightly about just getting a job and just focusing on that. But if I do that. Oh.
what I did wrong, like what could I have done right. She didn't respond, like she just ignored me. Like, who does that? If they're parked right, I would have been able to get it, but they don't know how to park. They didn't park it, the car right. Look, all this space for no reason. They didn't park the car right. Inappropriate parking. They should, if they were fine for that, they would have parked the car correctly. It's so annoying when people do that. Look, all of this space. Currently, I am in the school parking lot. I am about to go into my first day of class. Um, I'm a freshman hygiene student. Um, it was supposed to be my second year, but I failed lab last, last fall, so I had to wait another year to do it all over again. Um, how do I, f I feel completely I'm not too excited. I feel disappointed in myself. I've been feeling this way since December and it is now September, the start of the new semester, the new fall semester. And yeah, I'm trying to keep a positive attitude and be enthusiastic and do everything right. It's just, I really, really liked what I was learning when I read about what I'm learning. When I read about the dental material, my when I read my, my 
I really like what I'm learning when I read about it it makes me excited but the fact that I'm not where I'm supposed to be makes me a little bit sad especially my living situation is not the best right now if I you know if I had a stable place to stay and my mother was okay um, or she was staying in the same place with me I would feel mentally more prepared but it's just right now things are a little bit rough and um, yeah so I'm gonna use this channel to just document my journey um, to you know so you guys could see my ups and downs and I'm gonna hang in there it's gonna be a rough ride um, yeah the reason why I created this channel is because I see a lot of um, nursing student channels I see a lot of um, other health career related but I've never seen a dental hygiene one and I'm in dental hygiene school and I was looking for a, for a channel like this just so you know um, so I could like get a sense of how everything is I could relate to someone but I couldn't find it so that's why I made this channel so it's gonna be a rough ride I'm gonna hang in there and I'm gonna work extremely hard I'm gonna work even harder than last semester so yeah I'm about to head into class Actually, class starts at at 9.30. It's 8.39. I'm going to just head in there. And, um, yeah, it's the first day of class. First day, first day of school. I'm feeling really, really sad. It should be my second year, but I had to, they made me take a semester off. And now I'm redoing, um, to redo clinic over again which is really really sad for me I'm trying to snap out of it because I'm not the only one um, the program started out with 32 kids and right now I think they have lost 12 people um, out of these 12 people only two people came back other people left because they couldn't handle it it was too much pressure and some people reapplied but they didn't get accepted because they didn't they were not working hard enough or they didn't pass the other, their other classes so therefore only me mm -hmm. and, another, and another student were readmitted into the program so I am thankful that they readmitted me and saw that I have the potential to complete the program success, successfully but at the same time it's just it really hurts I feel like if I had another professor lab I would have done a lot better because half the time like the questions that they were asking me on the test I, I read I studied thorough I did everything that I could like it's not it's not when I knew I was gonna fail like from the get-go from the beginning I was pushing hard and I you know I really feel like if I had another professor because like the questions on the test were just like uh, ages but you know, I have another chance, so I gotta make the most out of it. So, yeah, I will. I'll keep you. I'll keep you guys updated. Thanks.